Assalamualaikum and hi everyone My name is Ahmad Zik bin Muhammad Zin Today I will present a system peka IoT System peka IoT is the system pemantauan kualiti air Introduction to the system peka IoT Lecturer from the Faculty of Civil Engineering Have taken the initiative to treat the water in Bukit Gemilang National Defense University Malaysia Uh, this water is treated using the iron removal system method and the concept of fiber reinforced plastic FRP and combined with ultra filtration membrane. The result of the testing the treated water samples are the total dissolved solid TDS is uh, 37 ppm, the pH of the water is 6.5 pH and the turbidity value is 15 NTU. Okay, I highlight uh, these three parameters because uh, these uh, are the most important parameters that, ma that, ma that must be monitored uh, to ensure that the water is uh, safe to use. Okay, from the result of the water sample testing found that uh, the water that has been treated is safe to use based on the water quality standard from the United States Environmental Protection Agency. Next, we go to the problem statement of the system. Uh, the treated water will be stored in in a clean water storage tank. However, the result of the survey found that the researcher have deficiencies in monitoring and measuring the quality of water stored in clean water storage tank. This is because there is no device or system that can monitor and measure the level of water quality that has been treated. Next, uh, the objective of the system. First, uh, development of PERCA system IoT makes it easier for user to monitor and measure water quality levels. Second, design a mobile IoT device to measure water quality levels by measuring total dissolved solids (TDS), the potential of hydrogen (pH), and water turbidity values. Third, uh, development of web-based PERCA system IoT that is able to provide direct information and real-time monitoring of water quality even and can store data on water quality. Next, we go to the scope of the system. First, admin. Admin of the system is water research project leader. User is a water researcher. This is the prototype of the IoT level. First, uh, this is TDS sensor, pH sensor and turbidity sensor. TDS sensor is to measure the uh, is to measure the total dissolved solid uh, of the water. pH sensor is to uh, measure the potential hydrogen of the water. And last, uh, turbidity sensor is to measure the turbidity and clarity of the water. All the three sensor is connected to the Arduino Uno and the reading of the sensor will, will be processed will be processed by the Arduino and sent to the ESP then ESP will send the will send the data to the database also, also the reading of the sensor will be shown uh, on the NCD screen that is connected to the Arduino Uno Okay, this is the web-based system of PERCA IoT. Okay, then we go to the admin login. Okay, admin uh, can enter the admin ID and admin password. Okay, after successful login, it will be direct admin to the home. Okay, uh, at the home page of the admin, admin can see the uh, introduction of the system and the sensor sensor that is that is used to measure the water quality uh, admin also can register the user so that have been registered by the admin can access to the web based uh, system PERCA IoT user also can monitor the level of water quality admin can monitor the level of water quality by go to the page of current water quality Okay, after the IoT device is connected to the internet and connect to the server, uh, admin will receive the email notification uh, that show the system is connected. This table shows the condition of good water quality. Okay, for example, when the TDS sensor 
detect the water quality is more than 40 ppm uh, admin or user will get the notification alert uh, about the water quality that's all thank you